How you doing, everybody? I'm Brother Luke. This is Eric Wechter. We've been uh, the first song we're going to do is called Amplifier. I thought it was pretty, um, thought it was pretty appropriate to start with because basically what Amplifier means is uh, I feel like I feel like I've kind of left the the desire to be a star behind me, and uh, like back in the Bobby Brown days, you know, when I wanted to be Bobby Brown, you know, doing the Running Man and all that stuff. I didn't realize why I wanted to be a star. And then after years of, of writing and uh, my first album, I gave it a shot. Um, not th I didn't really know how to push it, and I kind of reached that plateau that I feel like most artists get when they're like, you know, what what is inspiring me to propel to do this anymore? Why Why, why should I play music? And I remember it back when I used to listen to... Uh, the little clock radios that I'm sure we all had when we were kids growing up, you know, like the little little tiny speakers on top of them. And I can remember listening to songs on there because at the, at the time we had kind of cheesy, uh, cheesy radio stations. I, I guess you would call them cheesy because they played like a, our hippest station, played like, you know, kind of love songs and stuff like that. And I can remember feeling what it was like when I listened to Lionel Richie sing a song or what it was like, you know, listening to uh, these love songs that made me, that inspired me and made me, you know, felt like, I felt like I was living life fuller when I heard this music. And uh, that's kind of where I'm at right now is I want to be, I want to be that to somebody. I want to be, uh, through my life experiences, I want to, in, I want to inspire somebody and feel like they're living life more and that's what amplifier is all about it's about basically saying you know I don't care where you're from I don't care what you do if you hear something in my music that that you like turn it up and it's that simple and that's why I, I named it amplifier it's also a double standard because <coughs> I don't have any guitars in my band and I called it amplifier because I'm dead set on showing that pianos can rock too better than Elton John. So check it out. Here we go. I'll be your weaknesses. I'll be your fantasies. I'll be the poison in the air that we all have to breathe. I'll be the president. I'll be your beauty queen. I'll be the homeless man that's sleeping on our streets. As I see, as I see, as I see. I'll be your Ku Klux Klan. I'll be your Rodney King. I'll be the ring that's in your bathtub you don't want to clean. I'll be your closest friend, I'll be your enemy, I'll be the music coming from these fucking keys as I sing, as I sing, as I sing, can I be your empire? of mind, I'll be your tattooed ass, I'll be the speech you got when daddy caught you smoking grass, I'll be your chemical, I'll be your diamond ring, I'll be the peaceful, easy feeling, Sunday morning has some bring, has some bring, has some bring. in you. I'll be the worst in me. I've had to find myself through space and all eternity. I've read your books on faith. I've read philosophies. It's taken all these years to find out that the truth it lies in me. It lies in me. It lies in me. Can I be your Me. 
dollar bills she got working at the bar and with a new clothes new shoes straight from the back of Hollywood well she's gonna go so far next song basically uh spotlight is uh, a song that i wrote about how kind of everybody in their own way wants to be thought of as special and th wants to be thought of as uh so somebody special really and <clears throat> you know i mean i can s it's about it's a song about making fun of people who uh you know want the big cars and they want the you know the lavish things in life essentially it's it's a song about uh people who who want to be thought of as special who want to be thought of as as somebody who's who's contributing in some way or in the limelight <coughs> and uh this song's really about how how i'm i'm not excluded that i i want to be thought of as somebody special but it's more simple. I just want the spotlight, and that's pretty much what this song's about. Is uh, my way of saying, you know, I just want to be in the spotlight. Give me a chance. This is called. It's called the Udu drum. For those who don't know what this is, it's uh, comes from Africa, and basically, it's called the Udu drum because when you play it, everybody goes, ooh.
You see, Frankie's always dreamed of being rich, hanging out with the big wigs. He sips Dom Perignon in a sparkling clear glass on the beach with his 40D overstuffed silicone friends. And his wife has a big fluffy dog she can jog and a maid named Ken. And that real expensive art that's painted from those famous dudes hanging over the table for 10. Yeah. She's got big dreams, big car, heading for the city. She's gonna be a big star. Cause see, back home, they just ain't looking pretty. No, 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 no. She's got a pocket full of cash, one dollar bills. She got working at the bar. And with uh, new clothes, new shoes, straight from the back of Hollywood, well, she's gonna go so far. Yeah. Look at me in the spot. Two, three, four. Uh. One, two, three. Frankie drinks too much in a Sunday juvie and the budget's lost for his next movie and the ball and chain packed up three faces ago. Julie lives downtown, lost a good 50 pounds, got a job as a singing for a gram. And she go home, but she can't remember where she's from. Well, all last month I got the flu with no gigs coming in and my rent due. I drove around to look for myself a job. I found this place that I thought was cool and as I walked in I felt like a fool. Cause I hired some guy right on the spot. Cause he's from the real world. fuck is that? Is that a TV show? I heard that was a TV. Today my Look at me in the spotlight The spotlight All I want is a spotlight The spotlight All I need is a spotlight The spotlight I just want to say, uh, if you're interested in uh, checking out the band live or, or purchasing a CD, we have a CD for sale. I'm actually, uh, depending on when this airs, but like right around uh, November 15th, 2003, um, I should have a new album called Amplifier. Well, I don't know why they still call them albums, you know? I mean, it's like CDs, really. There's no more albums left. 
except for DJs, you know, they keep it vinyl. But um, we'll have a new CD available, media, if you will, uh, on on our website, imbrotherluke.com. That's like imbrotherluke.com. Yeah. Doink, 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 hang, 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 doink, doink, hang, doink, doink. Yeah, I am not ashamed to do cheap advertising, that's for sure. So uh, check it out. Uh, the, new, the new CD amplifier will be out very soon, November 15th, 2003. In short, I guess this is a pretty simple song. It's just about having a good time. Um, I recently took my brother's son, um, which is my nephew, obviously. <laughs> um, we took him to, uh, uh, we were recently visiting my dad, which is still living in my hometown of Kingman, Arizona. And uh, we recently took him to play basketball. Uh, I recently took him by myself to play basketball and we ended up at my old junior high and shooting baskets where I used to shoot baskets when I was in junior high. And just, man, being on the set and being on, or, or not the set, but being on the school, at the school, you know, on the court was, was just like bringing back all of these memories and these hormones that, were, that I used to have back then. And it, it just uh, wrote a song about one. Here, here it go. Well, it's 8.45 back in 86 uh, I can't stop looking at my English teacher's tits Saying something that it sounds like the phone in Charlie Brown The bell stops ringing, get the hell out of class I'm sporting off my brand new parachute pants The dance is coming, man, I hope that we have a bloody day this year All the cute girls in school Andy Devine's gonna have a parade It sounds so boring but I might get laid Such is life down here in Kingman AZ In DA skin.
You got those eyes. I bet your dad's side was Asian, and your mama's probably richer than hell. Hey, little girlie, with your fake memories, I got the mind of a monkey, and my daddy will tease. From the planet Zoltar. I've got this great idea. Let's go and play Andy Griffith. You're the sheriff. I'm your prisoner in jail. It ain't nothing but skin. 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 is sing about what I would like to do in a song and hope that people feel uh, the impact of uh, the music and what it's about uh, rather than uh, kind of banging your head. I, I think I really don't, I really don't, honestly, I, I really don't know how to ex explain it other than playing it for you because I hope you can make your own judgment on what it means. And in my 
dream I'd see a world where skies are clear and oceans clean A place where all the living things can truly be as one To leave reality behind On this land, no governments to glorify the greedy man, and there's no countries filled with poverty and people on the streets to leave reality behind. song is closer it's like how are we going to handle it when when you know I'm, you know we're we're closer like an elevator Look a little 
basically this song was was written uh when I lost uh, somebody that was was dear to me. I, well, actually I I mean me and my girlfriend broke up was what it, really what it was. And uh <clears throat> and the song's not necessarily about losing your girlfriend, my girlfriend as much as it is just being pissed off because your inspiration is gone and you just kind of sit down and you just go, you know, it's it's not there. It's not happening. There's nothing in, to inspire me to play. So it's called Please Inspiration. Come back 